wild. They've gone from being really depressed to euphoric. Come on, England. Yeah. Shame the weather's not euphoric. I uh, know, not mm. at all, is it? Yeah, a really disappointing start to the week. This picture was taken over the weekend. There were a lot of cloud uh, on Sunday, but uh, a nice enough picture uh, all the same. Saturday actually was really quite damp and drizzly, wasn't it? It rained for, for quite a lot of the morning, but Sunday uh, was a little bit better. And the second picture, uh, grey skies were brightened up by these poppies uh, near York. You can keep your pictures coming in to the Weather Watchers page or we're on social media as well. So the Met Office today issued the provisional June statistics it has in fact been uh, a drier than average month um, uh, and this comes off the back of a really wet or a wet spring a really wet autumn and winter so that feels like a bit of a change it was cooler as well so even though we had that really warm spell of weather last week it wasn't enough to lift those temperatures uh, temperatures for the first half of june were two or three degrees below average believe it or not it has been sunnier the uk had around 12 percent more sunshine than the long-term june average but the first week of July, very disappointing indeed. Tomorrow, not too bad. It'll be breezy. There's quite a lot of cloud around and there will be a few showers in the mix as well. So last week, uh, well, we had some lovely weather, didn't we? But this week, the Atlantic has now taken over. So the weather system's coming in from the west. You can see those isobars coming down from more of a northwesterly direction. So temperatures below average for the time of year. And we have had damp, drizzly conditions through today, a weather system tail end of a cold front actually uh, moving east. So it's still very cloudy out there with some patchy rain and drizzle, which might just continue, particularly in the east at times overnight, hopefully easing a little later. We'll start to see perhaps some breaks pushing down from the north and west. Temperatures underneath that cloud, though, dropping no lower than around 10 or 11 degrees. A quick look at the high water times at 1.23 in Whitby and at 1.36 in Scarborough. So if we do start off with a lot of cloud, we should see some breaks in that cloud through the morning, some sunnier spells, but the cloud will tend to build, build and fill out again and produce a few showers through the course of the day. So often quite cloudy, uh, quite breezy as well. Uh, a moderate to fresh west northwesterly breeze and temperatures below par for the time of year. 17 or 18 degrees, 17 is 63 Fahrenheit. And we'll continue on a similar vein into tomorrow evening. Uh, the odd shower, fairly cloudy conditions. Into Wednesday, more clouds still. The cloud thick enough for some rain and drizzle spreading in from the west. Quite windy conditions for Wednesday as well. Windy with sunshine and shower, so slight improvement for Thursday, but overall disappointing. Yes, thank you. Not the best way to start the week, Keely, but I do thank apologize. you very much. <laughs> I will not hold you responsible. Hello there, good evening. I think tomorrow it will be quite as dreary as today, but there will still be a lot of cloud around, quite a breeze and a few showers as well. Any sunshine fairly limited, but more sunshine than we'll have on Wednesday. Uh, it looks like there'll be outbreaks of light rain and drizzle spreading from the west at times. So out there at the moment, there's a lot of cloud. There's some pockets of light rain and drizzle, especially in the east. These will tend to fade away towards dawn, although there could still be a little dampness left and temperatures will drop back to around 11 or 12 degrees. We'll start to see some uh, breaks in the clouds, so some early sunshine spreading in uh, from the north. So that thicker cloud will thin and break, allowing some brighter, sunnier spells. But overall tomorrow there will be a lot of cloud, that cloud thick enough to produce a few showers in places, quite breezy conditions too, uh, a moderate at times fresh west northwesterly breeze and temperatures a little below par for the time of year. Into Wednesday, a lot of cloud, Windy conditions too, with outbreaks of rain spreading from the west.